Assalamu alaikum my name is Muhammad Shumas Riaz and you are watching my youtube channel in this video we will see that how we can simulate a equilibrium reactor having equilibrium reaction in it so what is an equilibrium reaction an equilibrium reaction is a reaction in which, in which uh, when you start the reaction after adding product, uh, reactants and giving the favorable conditions so at some time uh, at some time after some time uh, the reaction will, will come at equilibrium and at this equilibrium the reactants and products are uh, present uh, in the uh, present simultaneously so uh, we have we are having an example of equilibrium reaction that is water gas shift reaction in which carbon monoxide uh, reacts with steam to produce carbon dioxide and hydrogen so uh, that is the example of equilibrium reaction so let's start uh, on the screen now you will see that the reaction uh, so that is the reaction so now uh, we will get started first of all uh, we components list so we will add the components that are carbon monoxide and carbon dioxide and water and hydrogen so that's all for our components list for fluid package these are gases uh, pen robinson is a very good uh, fluid package for gases so i will select uh, pen robinson and after this i will go to the reaction so in we are having only one reaction and that is uh, we i will go click on this add reaction and now i will click on this equilibrium reaction so add reaction reaction one i will double click out in and add component the first component is carbon uh, monoxide that will react with carbon uh, water or you can say steam to produce carbon dioxide and hydrogen so as you have seen previously in the balanced equation uh, that one mole of carbon monoxide will react with one mole of car uh, with react with one mole of uh, steam or water uh, to produce uh, one mole of carbon dioxide with one mole of hydrogen so you can see that uh, balance error has uh, come to zero so our this reaction is ready after this we will add this reaction to fluid package now we will straight go to the simulation here I will click on these reactors and I will add a equilibrium reactor I will drag a equilibrium reactor reactor and I then I will double click it so the streams that are entering one is for carbon monoxide so you can say CO the second stream is for steam so I will write as steam so on the vapor outlet I can write as gas on the and on the bottom I will write as down so you can change uh, these variables according to your uh, need I had just write uh, there is no hard and fast rule to take these uh, names so when I will click enter the it will says requires a reaction set so I will go to the reactions and add a reaction set one so it is uh, saying that not solved because I had not uh, defined the uh, uh, variables or you can see the these uh, uh, temperature pressure and molar flow rate so for carbon monoxide uh, you can write the temperature as 35 uh, for uh, pressure you can write 101.325 if you are given with some other pressure you can write this as well for molar flow rate I will take as 100 uh, and uh, okay 100 for more composition uh, I know that it uh, in this I am having 100% uh, carbon monoxide so I will write one for carbon monoxide and okay now uh, stream so it as it is steam if temperature will be 100 degrees 
because it is steam uh, water will only be present in in the in the form of steam at 100 degree so pressure i will take as uh, not take as 101 i will take as 3 you can take 3 bar 4 bar i will take as 4 bar so in kilopascal it will become 400 so molar flow rate um, you can take as uh, you any value that is given to a you I will take as 350 kg and for its composition for steam component I am having only 100% steam so steam so as I had uh, cl uh, now click uh, on this uh, click button so you can see that all the values had been solved so that this is the way I can this is the way we can uh, simulate an uh, equilibrium reactor in Aspenisis. So that is you can say that uh, the composition of uh, gas and uh, compositions you can say in the down and gas uh, if you want to see the uh, moles that are were entering so you can just results and reaction balance so here you can see that how many moles were entering and how many moles had been uh, not reacted input output all the things you uh, the moles you can see that the moles that were entering that reacted or not reacted. so that's all for this video uh, i hope you had uh, i hope that this video will help you in your understanding if you have any questions you can uh, write in uh, comment box I will try to answer them uh, please like my video share my videos and subscribe my channel assalamualaikum